Hello and welcome back to Game of Thrones mod for Crusader Kings 2. This should be the last week of the Ironborn series. We have six episodes to go, plus one wrap-up episode at the end. So, uh, let's get started. So, what are we in a war for? Hmm. Yunkai's trade war over Lannisport. Um, okay. Well, I suppose it's something to do. Um, we have not a lot of men. How many do Yunkai have? Imagine they have a lot of men. They do. Did I already raise the men last time? I did indeed already raise the men last time. They're already have the boats ready if you want to jump on boats. I'm far ahead of where, of where I thought we were. Okay. Well, I guess we'll let kind of time move on. Now, usually at this point, what I might do is I might do a thing where I just give us a bunch of titles and I see how we can do. That like might say, okay, we're going to give us... Um, also, wait, when did the Westlands get control of that? I think got control of that last episode. Anyway, um, I might give us like claims on titles and things that like I've done that previously, and then we we'll see how we do. However, they do have ninety-three thousand men in Westeros, and we have like two thousand men. So I'm not thinking that's the way we're going to do end this series. I think we might just let it uh, run its course. Uh, we do have a child lack some military education, so this is Ragnar's child. Educator is currently us. Um, he seems like he would do well in an intrigue style focus. And we will find him somebody who is intrigue, um, like, you know, focused for him to uh, be educated by. Uh, how about Glazia? There we go. Right. Oh, he wasn't being educated by us. He was being educated by Snefar Air. Oh, well, doesn't matter. It's fine. We do have a lot of money now that I'm thinking about it. Oh. Balin of Harrodon Hill's decision to attack a fishing village produced a fight that was hard fought and a few of our men were lost. But none can withstand the might of the Ironborn. We've claimed our iron price today, winning our plunder from these weak people. Oh, we actually got a lot of money from that little reaving. Hmm. Maybe that's a plan. Maybe we want to try and just go all out. Let's just see if we can win it. Hmm. Okay. Okay. When this reaving is over... Oh, we got another, we got another successful thing. When this reaving is over, we will decide what we're doing next. And it may be that uh, we give ourselves some claims and see how we do. So, Janessa of Skagos. Uh, we are spying on her because we want her heir to be in charge because then our sister is married to the leader of Skagos. Okay. Um, she's telling shocking lies about rightful liege. Oh, we'll inform the liege, obviously. Because he may imprison her and get rid of her. Oh, he, he will use it to blackmail her out of uh, factionalism. Hmm, okay. That's not so good. Not so good at all. Um, I'm trying to remember what the claim command is. It's something like um, claim space, then the title, which would be something like E underscore the Iron Throne. Something like that. I don't know. We'll see. I'll look it up before we do it. Aha, a boyar has been built in Serpent Tail. Now that's great because uh, that means that we now have men that's like actually multiplying here. So we could actually raise more men if we wanted to. Well, I mean, if we hadn't already raised them all. Um, we could get another boyar, which would give us another 220 men, which would give us more that we could work off. Um, we could. How long will that take? That will take. 911 days, or we can get, uh, let's see, any, one of these must give us men, right? Or we can get 120 in a two-thirds of the time. Uh, I think we just want another boyer. Actually, oh, that's upgrading. Does that give us, I assume that means, that doesn't mean that it's going to give us 15. Yeah, I assume that doesn't mean it gives us a 15 extra. For that price. Yeah, that must be a full upgrade. Okay. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah. Balin of Harrodon's Hills weaving has come to an end. We have returned from across the narrow seas after getting much plunder and capturing many salt wives. We are true ironborn. The Regency has ended. And we are going to go on Operation Suicide Against the World. I have the titles. So... Let's set the scene. Well, I have the commands. Let's set the scene. Iron King Josran has just wrested control of the Iron Isles back from uh, Jacar Sor. He 
Let me double check I got this right. <laughs> yes, he has wrested the Iron Isles back from Jake Carstor. They are now in control of the Serpent Tails. But he wants more. He wants a lot more. He wants all of Westeros. He wants all of the Reach. He wants the North. He wants the Stormlands. He wants Dorne. He doesn't want to do a single bit of the bit of the work himself. He is going to hire mercenary bands from around the, the globe. And we are going to attempt to take on Westeros. Now, let's have a look at the Iron Throne. So, we are going to fabricate our own claim on it. Claim E underscore Iron underscore Throne. That should have just given us a claim on the Kingdom of Westeros. Which we will now press. We cannot press this because we have men raised. This is fair enough. Which we will now press. We will claim Westeros for ourselves. Yes, that seems about right. I mean, we could have done invasions, but we didn't have the right uh, stuff for them. We didn't have all those right traits or anything. No, we'll, we'll just go for claim Westeros. There we go. The Iron Isles are in a state of war. We should send ravens to the Great Lords, rallying them to the Crown's defense. We will raise up our small number of men and our boats. We will then raise up all of our mercenaries who will need to go on said boats. We will raise up the cell swords and more cell swords. Do you want three? I think we can have three. Yep, we'll have three sets. And then do we want any boats? We may need to hire some boats. Let, let, let us see. So, let us merge all of these over. How many boats do we have? We have... We can't have these boats from anywhere. Um, we currently have 100 boats. Now, what are we going to do for our 100 boats? Um, that would allow us to hold... I have no idea. How much can one boat hold? Uh, one boat can hold uh, 100 times. So, if we have 100 boats... That means that we can hold 100,000 troops? 10,000 troops. 10,000 troops. How many troops do we have? Good question. Uh, we currently have about 6,000. Okay. Okay. We can hold that many. Everybody, get on your boats. Get on your boats. Get on your boats. Get on your boats. There should be every army that we have in a boat, apart from this army. Which is going to get disbanded because it's in the wrong place. Okay, we'll merge up in the sea. Oh, wow. There's a, there's a massive army. Oh, no. Uh, Travelers wing rumors of fire and blood. They say dragons live once more and that Sinaris Magar now rides Vagar into battle. Vagar is very old at this point. Does the world have room enough for another dragon rider? Uh, well, I hope not. Alright, let's merge up. Yes, I also gave up on the dragon search. I feel that was a folly that wasn't going to happen. Um, we will have some leaders. We'll have Ronald, um, Theon, and Balin. Great names. Uh, important decisions. Face the dragon. Sure. One last time. For fun. And then we will head all the way over here and we will land on Dragonstone. If we find the dragon this time, I'll be very disappointed. Nope. No dragon. Nope. Still no dragon. You know what? Let's do it again. Face the dragon. One more time. Quentin Sarmentale, our son. Um, we will educate him. Uh, he seems to be very into intrigue. Maybe we'll, we'll go for int Um, Actually, we'll go pride because uh, we want him to be... Uh, well, that's just where he should be going towards. Uh, and we don't want to educate him ourselves because that sounds like work. So we will educate him with... I don't know. He seemed into intrigue. Oh, well, that is what we're into. I suppose. Uh, we'll give him to Ethan Wilson. Uh, I didn't click accept, did I? Apparently, I'm slothful in real life as well. I just won't bother to click the accept button. Oh, he needs to be at least six. Well, I guess we'll educate him until then, at least. Uh, Marjorie Swirt is currently under my control, and our close relative is currently opposing us. We can execute her or imprison her as a warning to our, uh, to our enemies. Um, I don't really want to imprison or execute her. I think imprisoning her is very fair. Uh, we'll definitely imprison her, though. Um, okay. People are failing to answer their call to arms because they're imprisoned by us. Fair enough. We didn't find a dragon. 
I guess we have to give up. To Dragonstone. This this may not last the full six episodes. This may uh, end in failure. Either ends in failure or ends in Westeros. And these are our two options. Um, okay, new important decisions are available. Face the dragon. No. Well, we had some charity work going well. Let us land over here and see if we can win the war. This is pretty much our only chance is land here, see if we can siege it and win the war this way. We can assault this down. She's currently leading troops somewhere else. Hmm. Okay. I found out nothing new about Lady Janessa. Well, let's make stuff up. Definitely. Definitely. We gonna assault this down soon? Mm, it's very slow going. I don't think an assault would even go very well. And if we keep sieging, there's a chance that um, she um, fails, basically, and um, like she loses her army somehow or she stops controlling it. And that would be very good for us. My kinswoman, Munda, makes sure everyone gets exactly the same amount of whatever sweet the cooks give the children. Um, okay. Um, I guess I'm proud of you, Munda. Uh, also, Munda, uh, I'm sorry, I don't want to educate you any longer. Uh, can you be educated by somebody who's not us? How about Ethan Wilson? Apparently our educator for everyone. My Lee, since I arrived in Harlow Hill, there's never been a shortage of soldiers reinforcing troops stationed there. Well, wow, good. Fantastic. Let us continue the siege. We uh, could assault it, but again, I think that the percentage that it's going down isn't high enough for us to actually assault. There's some weak claims we can press. Don't want to do any of that. No, definitely not. Some more sieges we could press if we wanted to. Where is the... I have no idea where these guys' army are. They have some up north, but the rest seem to be uh, elusive. A Martel died. All right. Okay. None have arrived on Harlow Hill yet. I'm not having much luck spying on Lady Janessa. Uh, she's up. She's up to something, I'm sure. Well, let's just keep up our siege. Ah, yes. Do Westeros even have boats? Uh, yes, I definitely saw some boats there. There was a Faith of the Seven Revolt. Okay. That is a very large number of boats. Not as large number of troops, but a very large number of boats. Actually, that might be the max number that could fit on the boat. Uh, no. No, they could fit a few more on, I think. No, that was the max number. Never mind. Uh, special things I can do. I can call this princess for trial. Definitely not. No. Why would we call her for a trial? She's only imprisoned because we're against um, her relative. Your captain of the fleet, Lord Sneffer of Orkman, has come to you for... With a suggestion, my lord, it's of my opinion that Lauren of uh, Frostbite Keep would make an excellent military commander. You think? Uh, no, he's Craven. I am the rightful ruler of the Seven Kingdoms. King's Landing is integral part of that title. It should be mine. Oh, okay. We'll just get a claim on that too. That's fine. To my liege, the good Iron King Jostran, it's not escaping me that several of your commanders lack formal training in military tactics. I would like to offer my services by training Dermond, Wolfgar, and uh, Vaisadar in use of advanced uh, battlefield strategies. They would all gain the trait Trickster? No way! No! Trickster is a bad trait! <laughs> it's actually a bad trait! Uther the Tickler is a serf of the High Lordship of Galtown from Lord Uther the Priest Tater, so Wayne Woods have taken land from the Red Forts. We're almost sieged this down. Have uh, they reached Harlow Hill yet? They have not reached Harlow Hill yet. Your Grace, for far too long, Nilo Varerian has occupied my rightful seat. Um, yeah, unfortunately, I'm not that interested in giving away my money. I'm sorry. Also, it's against the Pirate Lord N uh, Nileo. I love as a title. Okay, the autosave didn't fail. Fantastic. We'll keep going. Our siege is going strong. Hopefully, we catch someone who's worth a lot of war score. Master Wolfgar is no longer our just a car. We need a new just a car. Uh, let us go for uh, somebody who we like. How about Uron? Here we go. Uh, not sure I want you to do a run, so you just kind of sit there and uh, look pretty. 
Well, we took over that land. We got a bunch of war score for taking it. It's not enough, though. And I don't think we caught a single prisoner. Next one. We'll siege. Definitely assault that down. Assault the next one. Uh, almost there. Nine days. Assault the next one down. And then we'll assault this one down. There we go. We've taken all of Dragonstone. But yet it was nowhere near enough for score. Um, okay. I, I, I can't help but feel like this is going horribly, horribly wrong. He's still leading troops in Maidstone. Is Maidstone over here? I don't think it is. Where is Maidstone? I'm going to have to look that up. Uh, find a region or title. Maidstone. Castle of Maidstone, Lordship. Lordship of Maidstone. So she's over there. Hmm, I guess she's going to the coast. Uh, well, let us... I say, can we bring the ships to us? Yes, we can land the ships and just park like that. Then we'll head along the rivers here. Can we do that? There we go. We can head along the rivers, I think. Yeah, it works. Um, someone was imprisoned. Was that uh, our captain of the fleet, I suspect? Probably. Um, Lauren of Crowspike Keep or Balin? I guess we'll go for Lauren. Lauren, uh, you are now going to train troops in Harlow Hill. Okay. Let's get our boats over here. Fighter flee. Your grace, an enemy host approaches, intent on circling the castle. What should we do? Uh, we'll be safest here, or I'll take my family and hide until it is safe. You stay here to defend the castle. You know what? No. We're gonna stay in the castle. I think we're gonna, we're gonna go down with the ship if we go down. Would like us to ransom our prisoner back. Alice Shieldbreaker. Um, how much? Ten, ten ducats? Okay, we'll have her back. Um, right, let's try to sneak. We, I don't suppose we can, we can't go along those because there aren't major rivers. Okay. Where are you currently leading troops? At Ranta. Where is at? That's the wrong one. That's the wrong one as well. At Ranta. Who is there? Oh, you're, you're heading down that way. Okay. Well, we'll follow on the boats because that's the quickest way around. Lord Steph of the Red Reaver has been released from the dungeons. Apparently, although he's still in the dungeons. Oh, I guess it changed dungeons, maybe? Gelmore Pike? Uh, sure, we'll pay the money for him. Wait, was that her army? Lean troops in Harrenhal. Wait, Harren Hall is in here, right? Yeah. We can't go along that. We can't go along that river. Perfect. That all counts as one. Is she still leading troops in Harren Hall? Gravesam, Gravesam, Gravesam is, is it here. How are we town? Gravesam, Gravesam, Gravesam. Shoreham. Uh, okay. I'm gonna have to look that up as well. Gravesam. Uh, find a title. Reeves Ham. Wait, what? Ah, oh, she must be jumping around the leaders. Alright, we need to land. We'll have a better chance of finding her that way. Rad some prisoners. Sure, we'll pay the money. We're looking for her army. Because if we can get her, then we win the war. Can it? Where is Can it? Okay, so she is heading along in a normal path up there. We can find an army. I'm sure there's a chance that we can win this. Uh, Brandstone? Oh, who died? That was Lacey Dustin died. She was married to Vaon Overton. The Bucklers have just taken land from the Tarth. Alright. We'll keep heading along. Maester Edmund is no longer our healer. We need a new Maester. Uh, we have none, so we have to send for a Maester. Okay. Right. Um. Okay, someone in Pentos joined me. I think. Yeah. So someone in Pentos definitely just joined me. Well, that's good. We we have one backer. 
And they have Blackwater Bay as their one backer. Um, they, they managed to get more men since we declared war, just as a point of interest. She's in dragons? Uh, okay, Maester that we sent for from the Sistil has arrived. Maribald. She went back to Dragonstone. I can't believe it. She, she managed to juke. I guess she was here, got on a boat. Well, she transferred over there, got on a boat, went round. Your Grace, the situation looks dire. If no relief comes soon, you could fall into the hands of the enemy. The time to escape is now. We may not get another chance. Um. Okay. What are we going to do? 33% chance we escape to the countryside. 66% chance we're imprisoned. Brave the sewers. Uh, less chance we're imprisoned. More chance we're injured. Or just give me the rope. 10% chance to die. Hmm. Now, uh, what are we thinking? I think sewers sounds maybe the best option for us. Well, let's try sewers. Your steward leads you down the storerooms to a passage you didn't even know existed. Beyond it, a dismal tunnel full, full of death and decay. You're only too glad to reach the moat in relatively fresh water. I hope I never do that again. It only now occurs to me that any family left behind is likely angry with me for leaving them in the hands of the enemy. Iron King Joe's friend of the Iron Isles escapes to the countryside. Fantastic. And Ethan Wilson now becomes our regent. Alright. I suspect this war did not go as well as it could have for us. Well, let us go land in Dragonstone and see if we can kill her. Uh, Balin of, Hall of Harrodon Hills attack on the enemy merchant uh, fleet seemed foolish. Seemed uh, foolhardy as enemy merchants were too alarmed for him to take their gold. They utilized the warships to good effect, not allowing the ironborn to board their merchant ships. We lost a few men, we should take back our iron price. Oh, interesting. That that happened because we're on boats. Oh, all right. that's that's kind of cool. Uh, we're gonna land. Uh, we need to send uh, someone to lead our center. I I guess Gior of the Cell Sword Infantry could do it. Oh no, Balin. All right, we've got Balin. We got Theon. Anybody? Has he got any skill? Leading an army. Uh, Brian of the Cell Sword Infantry could do it. Brian, as other people would call him. One of my informants, a young soldier with more vices than he can afford, has managed to gain the trust of Lady Janessa and now often stands guard outside her door. I don't understand how the film managed, but who am I to look a gift horse in the mouth? For enough gold, he might be persuaded to get rid of Janessa. Violently. Well, yes, that would be expedient. Definitely. King Clayton of the Reach declared the Reachman War for Lord Arik's claim on Fellwood on Storm Queen Rowan the Eagle. Okay. In disguise and meet up with my friend, Lady Janessa's burly arms when a shifty looking associate at a rung down tavern. Shamefacedly recounts how he attacked Lady Janessa in her bed and how she managed to break free and get away. I pat him on the shoulder and tell him it's alright. Outside I order my guards to tie up the loose ends. Okay. We've landed on her army. This is our chance. We capture her in battle. So we did not capture her in battle, would be my guess. Yep, to the Ironborn Idler Jostran. Your low character is the subject of Bravosi plays. I accept your offer of peace. We failed. We did not take the Iron Throne. And actually, I think that we are going to end the episode here. It's a few episodes early, but... I feel like we did, um, I set five episodes aside for our uh, last ditch effort to see if we could take over anything. Basically this was our test to see how strong we were and it turns out we were not very strong. We did however grow a lot from where we were and we will look at that next time. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.